All right, YouTube, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel, Ace Bendetta with Smell Better Fragrance. I am your host, Ace Benz, and I'm back with another video. Bang! Yo, over here, we talk about fragrances and all things to improve your lifestyle. As always, we want you to be better. We want you to think better. We want you to feel better, and we want you to smell better. So if you find this content interesting, do me a favor, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, help the channel grow, share this content, and leave a comment down below. Hit that notification bell so that you never miss a show. Yo, we back with another weekly fragrance rotation, man. This is number 16, you know? Let's talk about it. Let's get it. Let's go. Now on Monday, Monday, off day, chilling day, so I decided to go with something. One of the new fragrances in my collection and I went with the house of Narcisco Rodriguez, and this is Blue Noir EDT Extreme. All right, man, so let's get into it about this scent. Beautiful bottle, beautiful atomizer. The scent profile is absolutely beautiful. I mean, it really is. I love the way it smells, man. I really do. I enjoy the smell, but um, I'm not sure if it's for me. I'm not sure if it's just me, or if it is what I think it is. I feel like it's lacking in staying power. After a few hours, I forgot I had it long. That's just my first experience though. It could change, man. Sometimes it takes more than one or two wears to get the, to get the true experience, man. Sometimes it takes two or more um, wears to get the true experience from a fragrance, man. And, and this is not the first time that this happened to me, man, where I felt like there was no performance with a fragrance. But when I revisited that fragrance, man, it was a completely different experience. That may be the case with this one right here, man. We shall see. I'ma wear it again. I'ma put it on skin. I'ma put it on clothes. I'ma overspray. I'ma see what it's gonna do, how it's gonna perform, and if it will get me the positive attention that I so desire. All right, so now on Tuesday, man, I went with the House of Latafa, and this one is Amethyst. So this one, man, you got rose bergamot some more rose some jasmine oud some amber and some vanilla absolutely beautiful what a gorgeous fragrance man so i put this on because during the recording of uh, another video i realized how good this fragrance was or is i realized i hadn't experienced it in a while and i and i lost track i lost thought of what a masterpiece is like to be honest with you but just recording that video man it, it made me remember how beautiful this fragrance here smells man i mean i was like oh my god this is so good so being so good i had to put it i had to put it in my weekly rotation where out and about just you know to revisit the love of this fragrance man it's, it really is good something beautiful something delightful to work with man this is one terrific fragrance yes i know the weather has heated up but i went with like three sprays and i thought i thought this could work and and it did limit yourself on your sprays man you can wear this in high heat you can wear this any way you want to anytime you want to to be honest with you and that goes for every fragrance to be honest plus i work in the office environment so no problem cool air flowing all day so it was a good wear on tuesday again from the house of Otapa, by day i would and mothers so on the wednesday wednesday i decided to rock out with the house of parfums the marley and i chose greenly mm. so this fragrance man it's fresh it's easy going you get a blast of green apples and some woodsy notes in this perfume, man. It, it performed very well for me on Wednesday. It's it definitely, it's not a weak fragrance. I mean, my coworker was able to pick it up from down the hall and she said so. So I definitely oversprayed, probably, but it was a great wear for me, man. Probably my first time wearing it at work, as I can remember. I mean, another compliment. I was told how good I smelled. They said, you smell delicious and I just want to hide she just wanted to bite me but yo it was good fragrance lasted all day can't complain about this one 
I don't know if anybody's complaining about performance, but it worked well for me on Wednesday, man. Profons de Marley, Grandy, good work on Wednesday. So on Thursday, man, I went with the house of gold filling banks, yo. And this is a winner called Bohemian Line from Gold Filling Banks. That atomizer. Look at look at all that spray that comes out. Oh my goodness. Yes. Very good. Very good fragrance, man. It really is. This was probably the start of the week. I got so many compliments on wearing this fragrance, man. I mean it was at least four. This fragrance is sexy. It's alluring. It is zesty. It's vibrant. It's extremely bright. It's a mood lifter and a spirit enhancer, man. This is just one very good fragrance. I love for me, man, like, since I purchased this. I mean, look at the dip. I put that to use. It's a very good juice, man. Yo, that rhyme. I put this to use. Some very good juice. <laughs> anyway, good wear. Um, what was that? Thursday? Yeah, good wear on Thursday. Bohemian line by the House of Gold Filling Banks. On to the next fragrance. So on Friday, man, I went with uh, um one of my decants, man. And this is from the House of Mind Games, and it is called Blockade. Amazing fragrance, man. It's it's so perfectly blended, man. And I, I can't get enough of it. The mango is blended so well in this fragrance. I mean, it's alluring. It's so smooth, man. It's a captivating fragrance, man. This is probably, this is not just pretty good, man. It's absolutely a love. This is not just pretty good, man. I absolutely love this fragrance, man. I enjoyed the hell out of it on Friday. So much so that I went online. I'm looking at this $350 price tag for a full presentation, man. Yo. I started looking for a 30% off discount. I started, you know, considering paying over time for this fragrance. Payments would have been like $98 every two weeks. I was tempted to do so. If I could find a discount code, the substantial was like 25 to 35%, man. I may make that monthly payment or that bi-weekly payment, man. Because this is a beautiful fragrance. Very well done. I'm just this close to pulling the trigger on getting me a full bottle, man. I, I really do want a full bottle. Especially when I look at a 9ml decant and a 9ml decant is going to cost 60 bucks. Hey. It might be my next purchase, to be honest with you, man. I got a few more on the way, but um, I can see this coming into the collection in the future. Really close. Really soon. All right, now we on the Saturday. Saturday, I went with the House of Parfums de Marley again, and this time I went with Percival. <laughs> ah, man. So this one is fresh. It's powerful. It's sexy even. It's extremely smooth fragrance, man. It's very versatile. And, and generally, I get compliments when wearing this. But honestly, I was only around the wife um, Saturday, and she didn't say anything about it. Nothing at all. I mean, I guess, I guess she just it just didn't move her, but that's okay. I continued to smell myself for most of the day, man, and I enjoyed it. Sometimes, sometimes she'll say something, sometimes she won't. Maybe this is one that just didn't move her, because, yeah, maybe this just didn't do it for her. Next time I will ask her just to, you know, get her thoughts on it. See if she give me some input so I can have something to talk about. Give you guys some feedback on how it was received by, you know, people around me. Anyway, overall, it was a great wear on Saturday. And I enjoyed myself. I enjoyed Percival, man. It's a very good fragrance. Long lasting. A beast mode fragrance, man. You can overspray with this one. And not know it. Trust and believe. So be moderate when you wear this one, man. Maybe five or six sprays. Don't go 13, 14. You might not realize it, but you might chill somebody out. Good fragrance. Beautiful fragrance. Thank you. Now on the Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, man. It was Father's Day. And I decided to go with one from the house of bun number nine. And I chose Bleecker Street. I chose Bleecker Street because I hadn't got much 
much wear out of it, to be honest with you. I'm usually leaning towards um, Centerpiece and leaning towards Lafayette Street. So we went out, we rocked out with Bleecker Street on Sunday. Such a good fragrance, a great fragrance. A beautiful scent profile, man. Yeah, it's fresh, it's green. I do get that green or that cut grass smell, but it's, it's done so beautifully, man. It has this nice bright opening with some fruitiness to it and it's a detectable blueberry note. It stays fresh throughout the life of the fragrance. I mean, this is mature, it's masculine, and again, it's fresh and green, it's sweet. I mean, it's like nothing else that I have in my collection. It was a very good wear on Sunday, man. I enjoyed the wear of um, Belika Street from, from the House of Bun number nine. Yo, that's about it for me, guys. If you have either of these seven fragrances, let me know. If not, I suggest you give them a try. Good energy, positive vibes, save lives. Like always, follow the plan. Be better, think better, feel better, smell better. With that being said, I'm out. Hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Help the channel grow. Hit that notification bell and leave a comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you're rocking. Like always, I thank you for watching. I'm Ace Benz, a.k.a. Ace Benz, better with smell better fragrance. Until next time, smell good, smell better, and we'll smell you later.